right now in where else but Earth City. That makes with, sense. <laughs> with the latest power plant, Tim. Yeah, man, I am learning a lot this morning. I'm hanging out with Skip Bauer, who's got a great idea. Skip, thanks for joining us this morning. Now, you're, you're going green with your power plant here, right? Yes, uh-huh. Tell me about how this works. You've got, tell about what you have on the roof here. Well, we have uh, five solar panels, uh -huh. and they all, they puts out a total of 550 watts on, uh, with full sunlight. Uh, it's even putting out energy right now, even though it's a little bit cloudy. Um, and these solar panels keep a, a battery bank uh, charge up, uh, peaked out um, over a period of time, of course. And, uh, and how many? Uh, how much will that run? Uh, it's fully charged. In, in terms of uh, how much will it run? Yeah, how mean, much uh, wattage? I mean, well, 3,000 watts is 3, what this 000. is what this uh, inverter is set up for. Come in uh, here real quick, guys, and take a look. Here's a. This is a, the, the monitor the ants we're getting right now, right? This is this yes. is what's what's in the battery packs right now. Oh uh, yeah, that's 12 points. Uh, yeah, and that's. This is for what we're getting from yes, the sun. Yes, exactly, yeah, right now. There is Guys, no sun, though. How does that work, though, Tim? Well, just 10 to 15 minutes ago, this yeah. was at, like, 1. Uh -huh. The yeah. sun hasn't even fully come up yet. It's yeah. cloudy. It's not a yeah. beautiful day. And it's already getting enough power right now to almost start charging the battery. Yeah, it was up a little bit before. And yeah. It was, like, 12.8, and then uh, now it's dropped. It to, but it's a little bit still cloudy. As soon as the sun comes up, you'll see it's fine. Skip was in construction for years, and one of the benefits is this. If you're in construction, you can run all your tools off of this without having to use a generator that runs all day exactly. on gas. Exactly. Unbelievable. Yes. And, and the, the ramifications of this, that where it could go, are amazing. Home use, you said it, you were kind of sparked for this after the power outages and the storms last year. Yeah. And you were able to power your whole house overnight just off. Right. The ge I ran the generator during the day. Right. And then I thought, well, while the generator's running, I might as well be charging batteries, too. Sure. So then I could turn the generator off around 6 o'clock at night and run my house on, on batteries the rest of the night. And uh, didn't have to listen to the generator all night, of course, and pay for the gas, of course, and, and so on. And uh, that's what sparked me as far as uh, I thought, well, for construction, uh, they might only possibly want to use their generator, you know, uh, two, about a couple hours a day, you know. And be charged and, uh, the rest of the day. And then uh, they can, while, they're, while the generator is running, it's recharging batteries and so on. Here's so, the other benefit. You, you could save a whole day's worth of power by sitting this out in the field, say, on the weekend. Mm -hmm. It charges all weekend. You go Monday, you never have to use any generator power. It's charged. You don't ever turn on a thing. All of Monday, you get a whole free day of electricity. That's pretty amazing, right. Timmy. Uh, it is. Uh, he's got some great ideas. We're going to show you some more with it. If you'd like to talk to Skip more about it, here's a phone number where you can contact him for more information on this uh, prototype of a mobile power plant. Coming up, we're going to show you another modified version, a way you can save big bundles on your gas bills as well. I love the way that sounds. We've been having a lot of stories in the news this morning about higher fuel bills. Absolutely. Absolutely. All right, Timmy, hey, we'll check back with bingo. you. You got it. All right, we're talking about... Well, the last time we checked in with Timmy Zell, he was doing something good for the earth. Yeah, that's right. We're talking about alternative power, and it's really neat to see. Nice going green, isn't it, Tim? <laughs> oh, that's right. We're powering all sorts of stuff. How do I turn this on here? There, you got that working? We got my shop back working over here. All off power harness from the sun. It's a mobile power plant on wheels right here. We'll tell you all about it coming up on Fox 2 News in the morning. Why should you? You know, as the temperatures drop, a lot of folks get really, really worried about their high energy bills and heating costs over the winter. Especially this year because they're going up. Yeah, they are. Yeah, a lot of different areas you're going to be paying more. So, why not let the sun shine in? That's what Timmy Zell is saying this morning. He's in Earth City where it's not like he's going to the 60s. Let the sun shine. You're, 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 you're going green, in other words, Tim. I'm going green, man, like Kermit the Frog. Absolutely. Hey, we're, we're hanging out here in Earth City. We're talking about a, a mobile power plant of sorts. Paul, will you show us how this, uh, the, the nail gun working here? That's all running off this, this trailer behind us that has been put together by Paul's dad, Skip. And it's, it's got solar panels on top. It's all running off stored energy from the power plant. It goes to air compressor that's being powered by energy you got from the sun, right? Exactly. Unbelievable. Exactly. And, the, yeah. and the, the, the limits are really limitless because my, uh, you've got this on the, in a pickup truck. <laughs> Tell me about this unit here. What is this? This unit here uh, has, uh, it's a little smaller unit than that. It's, well, he has six batteries, that has nine. Gotcha. But uh, this one here, a guy, can, you can see, he can have it in the back of his pickup. Uh, 
he can uh, run run a crew of guys out of this thing pretty much all day, and then uh, and then at night take it home, and then just plug it in right here and charge it up from uh, from his house at night and charge it up for about 36 cents. 36 cents. You could charge this up and work on it all day. All your tools would run off of it. Yes. Uh -huh. Now, you mentioned earlier, if you had like a 5,000 watt, watt uh, generator, generator yeah. it would burn maybe six gallons roughly. of gas a day. Yeah, roughly, depending on the load. Yeah. If they ran it all day. Right. That would be, uh, at 250 a gallon, that'd be $18 a day to run. 36 cents to $18 a day. Add that up over the course of the year, you're going to save exactly. a lot of money. Exactly. And basically, it's pretty easy to work. You just, uh, you've got a couple outlets right here on the back. Right. And you can just plug this in. Yeah, I'm going to set this right up here. Okay. I'll let you, you lift. You get it? I think I can get it. Can you it? And look at that. And I got the power! <laughs> About 36 cents a day. And more power is on its way as the sun comes up for the mobile power plant with the solar panels on top. What, are you kidding me? <laughs> this is, it, it, it's like stealing money. <laughs> Hey, we are going green right here on Fox News in the morning. If you'd like a little more info on this mobile power plant that Skip's put together, well, here's the phone number. Give him a call. He can give you the 411 on it. And uh, don't worry about calling him at night. The phone's solar powered, too, at his house, so it's charged and ready to go. He'll get you. Cool stuff. All right, great stuff. You got it. Some good <laughs> ideas there, Tim. Thank you. It's 756. If you're on your way out the door, we've got to get you to work the easy way this morning. Sunshine now. This is Tim's live location there. Sun is up. A couple of uh, clouds here, there. But sun is powering the Timmy Zell power wagon <laughs> this morning out on his live shot. Yes, indeed. Had some rain yesterday. And now those clouds breaking apart to give us some sun. So a day of improvements, quick improvements for us. If the problem's out there, you'll want to go to myfoxstl.com, click on traffic, and see if your route is affected. All right, Monica, thank you. It is 813. Tim Azell's trying to light up the morning this morning. And he's doing it not with his electric personality, but with solar power. That's a first for Tim. Tim, uh, how do you do that exactly? Explain this to us. I'm, I'm soaking up the sun right now. Okay. That's the mobile power plant that this mobile power plant is absorbing its power from. We're with Skip Bauer, who's invented this thing, and uh, yeah, this is a prototype. You mentioned these can be custom made pretty much for any business, what their needs are, really. Yeah, definitely, yeah. I, talk about what's on top. You got some solar panels. Yeah, there's five solar panels up there. Right. And they put out uh, 550 watts under full sunlight. And, exactly. Uh, um, it charges how many and batteries? It, and it charges, in this situation, there's, there's nine. Uh, the configuration can be whatever the need or need is you know right. it, uh, it uh, uh this particular setup there's nine batteries with a 3000 watt uh, inverter right and uh basically uh, you know the solar panel charges these batteries keeps them peaked out it's allowing us to watch you guys right now we got a tv on in here <laughs> we got the microwave we got the that. computer yeah we got to have our, our randy and perch going <laughs> we got some coffee going here uh, the sun is constantly charging this thing. Step out here. Oh, excuse me. I got my shop back on. I can clean up after you guys. <laughs> I can run the nail gun. I can run the saw. And this is great in a construction sense because when they're out there on the job, it's right. going to run the generator all day. You right. mentioned right. they get all the power they need. Right. We got hey, nail Timmy. guns. Yeah. We're running it all. I have a question, Tim. Yeah, where is it? Give yeah, it to me. <laughs> would this be, would this, this is just kind of a recreational call. idea, but could you use it camping? I don't know. Could you use it where? Like if you go camping or Big something. Camper. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I mean, you could use it for a, for a camping oh. trip. It oh, would be great that. for campers or hunters, you mentioned. Yeah. They, it, you know, they even camouflage it for you. <laughs> and you can take it out there, and yeah, it'll power everything you need. Yeah. And as you mentioned, here's the neat thing about this one. If you're using it on a job site, park it out there on the weekend, it'll completely recharge over the weekend. You won't have to run any generator to charge the batteries on a Monday. You'll get a free day of power on Monday hmm. after it charges over the weekend. And you, yeah, it, it's amazing. Lot, yeah. The possibilities are pretty much endless on this thing. He's thinking green. My we man Skip it. is thinking green, so I'm giving him the first ever <laughs> Timmy Zell Brain Award. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Brain power. Oh, thank you. He's got a green brain. We all you must can. be we so can proud. Start harnessing the power of the sun. <laughs> he gets the green That's brain the award. <laughs> There you go. That's Congratulations. Very, very proud. High honor. Thank All right. You. <laughs> See, that now that's good Gore, TV, that's Tim. <laughs> I know. Take that peace prize away from Gore. Thank you. That's right. You got it. Kids can learn from that. They absolutely can. But you know what? They saw it on TV 